Hit it, Dee Dee. It's the uh, double E bop. Okay, I thought uh, it's time uh, we could do a power demonstration, a power up a machine here. I can, uh, been on a little um, trail of uh, work holding and uh, suitability and things. And, uh, I'm going to uh, demonstrate this uh, Buck 6 inch adjust shoe truck. It's an older one. It, it's semi steel instead of the Ford steel like the later ones. And uh, it's got the solid type jaws. So, okay. Now, what I got in here is a. Uh, an old time thing called a drill bushing and it's precision ground on the outside and I thought that'd be nice because it's smooth. Oh, it, you see I got it in there pretty good. That's a one-eyed hammer. You have to have that because you see you look and then you go tap tap tap. Okay, so that's in there. Okay, and it says it's like a brass bushing and you don't want to hold it very tight because uh, you'll, you'll distort it. So we got, you know, tight, but not too tight here, okay? Okay, let's, um, let's fire it up. Now, this also, I'll find out if you can hear me um, with the racket of the machine. Now, I'm going to start the motor generator on this older lathe. <laughs> Okay, we got uh, we got Scotty down in the engine room here, the motor generator, and uh, so I'm going to put it in uh, open belt, open belt. Now, when I go, when I see where the I'm, I'm going to crank it down a bit here, make sure it's not going too fast. Okay, uh, this forward. Oh, that's sweet. See, stop, look at that, you go backwards. Look at this, go all the way. Do that all day long. Da -da. Okay, we're going forwards. And we're running. Oh, a little over 200 RPM there. Let's, uh, let's have some fun. Let's crank this thing up full blast, okay? I'll wrap it up here. thousand here. It, this takes three turns of the knob, like three and a half turns of the knob to crank this thing up. The, the tool making lathe over there, the 83 is, is less than one turn. So I have to sit here and crank this thing like, I, I don't know, like I'm screwing something in. So we're at a thousand. Oh! Fifteen hundred, seventeen fifty. Oh my God! Turn it back here a little bit. I got it. I went way ahead. That's two thousand. I, I hope this. I gotta be careful here. I don't. I'm gonna try it here. See that? It wanted to come out. It almost flew out of there. Look at that. Will you look at that? Okay. And that's only two thousand RPMs. And I don't really uh, want to go by the side of that truck real bad. You know. So I'll just kick it off here, okay? Oh, isn't that sweet? Okay, I'm gonna crank her down. Power down. Oh, okay, Scotty, take a break. Now, let's look at this thing here. This thing's not loose. See that? that? That bushing's stuck in there. I can kind of tap it back. Okay. Well, what happened is this chuck expanded because there's nothing there. If you think about a six-jaw chuck, it's just like this front piece is all cut away for these jaws. The, the sh shell here is thin, and so this is a very poor work holder, and it's just absolutely worthless, worthless for high precision work. Now that we got that straight, um, I'll get back over to uh, the other machine and talk about other checks here. Okay, 